Hello guys, welcome to another episode of Trailblazer PVM Edition. And today's episode is all about the Corrupted Gauntlet and the gains that we've made thus far. If you guys are enjoying the progress though, make sure to leave a like on this video. That way I will know that you guys want more and I'll be pumping them out whenever I can. Nice. We got 63 crafting, which means uh, now I have 75 boosted. So I can uh, make some magic birdhouses now. Pretty much the best birdhouse because no redwoods. So. Oh my god, I just got a sub 2 minute hunt left time. Holy shit. That was crazy. Wow. <laughs> 42. Meaning of life. Meaning of life is... There's no meaning because I keep getting crystal weapon seeds. I have like five now. Alright, here we go. 50. Please. Please, please, please. First drop. Let's go. Oh my god. How is this possible? That's like my sixth crystal weapon seed, dude. Alrighty. Another chance, another chance. 57, boys. 57, here we go. Yes, let's go, first piece. Let's freaking go, boys. I'm not gonna wait any further. I'm gonna make myself the helmet. Hey, there it is, 58 smithing, and with the boost, a prodigy, 70. There you go. All right, we can make the helmet now. Here we go, first one. How much charge does this cost? Yes, I don't I don't ask again. It's all good. Okay, it's not bad. It's only like 50. Hell yeah, 100 points for that? Cool. So I'm using Scepter for Fighter 1. You can use anything. Oh my god! <gasps> what the fuck is Yo, what the fuck? Dude, holy shit. Wow, I can't work because I can't charge it yet. Oh, I don't have a tag level 75. Wow. Holy shit, dude. That's crazy. Oh, God. Oh, level up. You almost killed me. So there are some positives to getting so many crystal weapon seeds. I can at least convert them into shards. So we're gonna trade in seven crystal weapon seeds and get 70 extra shards. That'll help save us some time on charging this blade. So we need uh, about 500 more. And on top of that, we need to train our crafting and smithing, but Corrupted Gauntlet also trains these stats. So we'll see what we get by the end of, you know, the Corrupted Gauntlet after we get all the armor seats. Cause we might just get it from Corrupted Gauntlet, possibly. Oh, what? <laughs> New personal best. How, dude? That was a normal run. That was even a speed run. Yes! Let's go. Second armor seed. Finally, dude. Come on. Wow. 89 KC for a second one. Jesus. Let's freaking go, though. Four more to get. Four more. Only four more. Nice, 100 Corrupted Gauntlet done for 250 points, even though I'm not super speeding points, I still get points doing PVM, so. Yes, let's go, bro. Third armor seat, let's freaking go. Nice, 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 nice. Hell yeah, bro, just three more to go and we get the full armor set. Ah, three more to go. Beautiful. Ooh, wow, that's crazy. Wow, we, we're gonna we're gonna like get two of these done. <laughs> five hundred points, five hundred points. We can get this one done. Yeah, I think it's time for me to attempt sub five minute corrupted gauntlet. I pretty much am like max range now, so you know can't really get too much better than this. Oh, so close, dude! I ran out of food. Well, that was basically the run. Die. Die. Thank you. We got it. I'm pretty sure. Let's go. 
took a bit, but we got it. Oof. 500 points. Give it to me. All right, thank you. All right, no more speed running stuff. We're just going to do normal runs now, and uh, we're Gucci. Oh, right, like, let's go, man. That was probably the hardest thing I've done. All, uh, all leaks, bro. All leaks. For sure. Oh, we just hit 99 range. Dang, that's less points than uh, doing sub 5 Corrupted Gauntlet, Dan. First 99, cool. I'm gonna get like 50 mil range XP by the time this league's over. I'm not even gonna lie. Nice, another crafting level, easy. Oh, nice, we met the uh, crafting requirements to make the Blade of Salador. 119, oh yes! Yes! Oh my god, dude. The armor seeds. They're coming. Let's go. Number four. Number four, baby. Just two more to go. Wait, I got triple myth arrows? What the hell, man? I didn't realize that. <laughs> in in the thousands of corrupted gods I've done, this is the first time I've seen triple myth arrows. That is uh, cool. Stupid, but cool. All right. This is probably the gauntlet that's going to give me all the shards. I hope I get eight. Please, give me eight. Give me eight, please. Oh, nice. Max amount, dude. 1,001 shards. Oh, my God. Oh, it is done. It is done, boys. Now I just need to train one more thing. 82 smithing. Just need three more smithing levels. I'm looking at uh, Sokano probably. Yo, dude, freaking Equilibrium is so good for Sokano because look at that. I'm getting a uh, hundred and fifty six extra EXP on Runecrafting, dude. Holy shit! I think I'm gonna try to finish Sokano tasks, like you know, up to like a hundred or two fifty or whatever, because it's good XP. In the primary stuff and also a really good XP in like runecrafting and stuff, so. Ooh, 39 runecrafting. Let's go. The power of the equilibrium. Alright, that was a good session of Sokano. I out all my uh all my alcaboles. Check it out, check it out, boys. This is insane. Look at this. Check me out. 13 mil oh in the oh in the leagues, dude. Look at me. Rich boy over here. Oh, uh, yeah, I definitely will keep doing Sokano though later on. I think for the rest of the, uh, yeah, I'll do enough to maybe get enough shards to create the crystal armors when I have the seeds. Yeah, man, let's let's get cranking, dude. I got three thousand nature runes. I'm just gonna smelt some ore. Okay, ninety-eight percent, ninety-nine percent, and one hundred percent, one hundred plus percent. There we go. 82 smithing. Look at our XP rates, dude. This is insane. Super is really nice. 1.4 1, 1. Uh, mil magic. 650k just superheating like really weird ores. But oh my gosh, it is finally time, dude. Get this out. Get this out. I'll see you at the uh, singing bowl or whatever. All right, guys. Here we go. A thousand crystal shards and the blade of Saldor. Yes, please. I would like to make the Blade of Saldor C. Here we go. It'll cost 999 shards. That That's fine. That's okay. Oh, let's go, man. Blade of Saldor permanently charged. Never runs out. Yeah, we're going to put this on. And, of course, we can't put this on because I don't have 75 attack, but it's okay. I'm, I'm one level away. Oh, there it is, 75 attack. Instantly putting this on. <gasps> Holy shit, 500 freaking points. 500 points, dude. Oh, yeah, dude. Oh, I just hit my first 20, dude. Look at my stats, but guys. Let's do, a, let's do a quick comparison. Yes, I went from a level 40 weapon <laughs> that had a, had a stab of 50 and a strength of 56, you know, including... All the, all the other stuff too. Double. Oh my god. I basically just doubled my firepower, dude, right there. 
Nice. My melee is pretty much wrapped up for now uh, in terms of weapon. This is basically like my best weapon. You might be saying scythe, but the thing is blood runes are so insane. Uh, it's just not really viable. So it's either this or like the uh, Grazi Rapier. So we have this. It's freaking insane, dude. My melee is all sorted, dude. Our, our melee training is going to be nice. It's going to be chilling. Yeah, Equilibrium? Oh yeah, true, true. Oh my god, dude. Equilibrium? So with the control style, you are training attack, strength, defense, and hit points. So that means Equilibrium will proc four times. And at around 1500 total, that's 150 XP per proc. So every hit that I do, give me an additional 600 experience overall. Holy shit, yo. Yo, this is something that I can do that other people can't. You can camp two spawns with a crystal bow. Hell yeah, dude. It's so nice. Oh, I got it. Yay. That was so hard. Tell me how many kills to get a stupid cosmic talisman for your task. Because my god. Tell me 300. Yo, equilibrium for Jody. So nice. Look at that. I'm getting an extra 148 experience for every little uh, mini lap. So that's insane, dude. Look at that. 245. I normally get like 100. So. Alright. Thought I'd take a little break from Gauntlet to work on some uh, miscellaneous stuff. You know, point stuff. Diary stuff. So 71. That's nice. Uh, we can basically start working on the Mauritania Hard Diaries for the Bone Crusher. Really good. So we got one of those requirements out of the way. Oh, shit. Crystal and... Hell yeah, dude. This magic tree swat's nice. Alright. Whoa! Six Ranar seeds. Oh, baby. That is what's up, man. That is what's up. Cutting magic trees couldn't be any more beneficial, dude. Especially with the uh, crystal implant spawning right here. I gotta get some tasks done involving uh, magic trees, so... Works out well. Alright, my boy. Scatter one. Here we go. Oh, dart tips. Nice. <clears throat> Good stuff. Oh, magic birdhouses. Let's go. That's it, guys. We've peeked at the birdhouses. Can't get better than this. I'm trying to find my next AFK thing that I want to do when I go edit some videos or just, you know, retire. Don't want to do too much intensive stuff. And I'm, I've got it. I figured it out. It's going to be the czars. Uh, it's not gonna be Jad, it's just gonna be regular. Ah, uh, 106 Tazar, because you know why? Tazar is so many points. So many. Uh, look at these. Full Obsidian Armor Set, uh, Obsidian Cape, whatever, the shield, the sword, you know, all that stuff. Like, I can just AFK some Tazars and get get these. So, yeah, they're, they're really, uh, they're really good points. Alternatively, I could just uh, sell chaos runes and buy them because I'm rich, but I just need something AFK, you know, so this isn't too inefficient. I can also train my magic along the way, so that's not bad at all. Oh shit, 87 magic. Oh, nice. There you go. I got the uh, level 6 enchant unlocked now. Cool. That's for some future jewelry bling bling. Thank you guys for watching today's video. If you found this video to be enjoyable, consider giving it a like. We also have a friends chat. Feel free to join that if you want to hang out. And also, consider subscribing and ringing the bell. That way you will get all video notifications. And if you have Amazon Prime, feel free to subscribe on twitch.tv slash ricecup and you can financially support me for free through Amazon Prime. Anyways, thanks for watching. See you guys later.